All right, guys, I wanted to show you one of the best man beaters in the game for a quick concept. Now, this concept can apply to your playbook, can apply to any playbook that has this route combination in it. It's not a specific route combination. It's a specific route. This route cooks man coverage, and I want to talk about why in this video. What's up, guys? My name is Cody, and I want to welcome you to my YouTube channel. My YouTube channel is designed to help you get better at Madden 21. I do that through tips like this, strategy videos, live streams. I post four videos a day on YouTube, so if you're not subscribed, go ahead and click subscribe. But the best way to take your game to the next level is to join my Discord. My Discord is where I community, where we talk Madden all day. I give free tips in there. Uh, my members actually help everybody, and that's a, just a great community to be a part of. So if you're not already, be sure to join the Discord. Let's jump into this video. Uh, all right, so Dime 146 cover two man. Now this little concept right here completely changed my uh, completely changed my opinion of man. So uh, I'm in the Arizona Cardinals playbook again. This playbook just came out on my uh, ebook, so if you want to pick that up, uh, my Madden 21 offensive playbook is in there. Um, that link is in the description of this video. We've got an offensive book and a defensive book tied to that competitive uh, bundle. Doubles Y offset and the play that we're, I'm sorry, doubles Y or doubles offset week. And the play that we're going to be running is the play PA bubble Y over. Now I'm going to back the ball up a little bit to show you why this play is so powerful uh, against the meta formation uh, or the meta defense that you're going to see. So first and foremost, the reason this play is so powerful, and, and there's one step that you've got to take. So I'm just going to run the play here, and I want you, I want to show you what happens. So when you go into instant replay, let's just take a look at the routes. So this is just against. I think this is just standard two man under standard cover two man. So what you're going to see is this tight end route. You see you see this little man switch that's going to occur. See that right there. So there's a man switch that occurs. It's going to allow Gronk to get open against man to man. Uh, on the left side is the screen. You see you've got that stock fade. I love stock fades this year. You've got this bubble screen. We're going to talk about that in just a minute. But look, look, notice how the corner is just standing there. He's not moving with the bubble screen. That is something very interesting. Um, then on the right side, you've got this deep post over the middle of the field. And we'll come back to that in just a second. Now, um, let's do the meta where they shade coverage. Uh, outside over top and then they drop two purple zones and then they're going to use her the middle of the field with their little linebacker now watch this play against something like that and now you're going to see he goes with it so what we what we need to do it's actually just one simple adjustment and you see there you're able to get 10 yards so the simple adjustment that you're going to need to make is basically you don't want the play action. Um, you don't want the play action. You want to basically cancel the play action. If you cancel the play action, it's going to change everything for this play. So literally all I'm going to do is I'm going to put my running back on a swing route to the right so I still get the man switch on Gronk. And what you're going to see here, snap of the ball. I can throw this ball right here, and I can get seven yards easy every single time against man-to-man. -man. Literally, let me just show you my adjustments on defense. I am man aligning, press coverage, shade outside, shade over top, dropping the middle linebacker into a zone, dropping both of the outside guys in purple zones, and then I'm going to pass commit. And what you're going to see, snap of the ball, see how that guy still stands there? When you cancel the play action, I don't know why this happens, I think it has to do with something about the way the game is programmed, but literally when you cancel the play action, it changes everything. And so this is a very, very simple way that you can beat man-to-man. -man. And I'm going to show you what the defense is going to have to do to stop it uh, in just a second. So literally, you can just block the running back, too. You don't even have to put him on a route. Uh, if, you want, if, you want to get a, if you want to get a good um, man switch, uh, what I, like, I do like to put him on a route for that situation. So literally, I'm just going to do this. Well, what you'll see, what happens to Gronkowski, you're going to get that little switch right there. You can, um, ah, didn't get it quite on that play. But typically, typically with Gronk, um, his route is going to get inside leverage uh, at different points. So you can run, you can run uh, McCoy on an option route. Really, it doesn't even matter. But you're going to see here, you can hit. You could hit Gronk. Um, I think if you smart route it, maybe. Let's see. See how it's a quick angle? So if you smart route that angle, get it to go a little bit deeper. 
Watch how it does against men. Pass it inside, click on. Eh. His route more his route is more of his own route. <laughs> um but what you'll see here, like this bubble screen is so good. And then this route to Scotty Miller, um, he's going to get inside release, click low ball that, and you're going to be able to have a good shot at getting that catch. Again, the better receiver you have out there, the better that route is going to work for you. I like to smart route his route so he only goes 10 yards. Um, and you'll see right here, click on, and you're going to get these inside pass leads um, against that coverage. Now, what's cool about this is you can motion Scotty Miller into. And you see they're able to get it into uh, Scotty Miller on that play, on that route. Now, what they're going to have to do is, let's just say they run, um, this is what they'll start trying to do. They're, they're going to try to stop it with man first before they'll go to zone, I promise you. What you'll see here, here's shade coverage underneath. Literally, nothing you can do. There's nothing they can do. So they're, what they're going to have to do, and this is what's going to open up other routes for you, is they're going to have to go to some type of zone coverage, right? Man's not going to really do it. The bubble screen is stock going to beat man, man. So they're going to go to some type of zone coverage. Well, most zones will fall away from this. Um, you see there, the you see there, the cover T sync does does come down on it. Watch what happens late in this route. Again, all I'm going to do is take McCoy and put him on. Um, some type of route. You can put him on a ghost route if you have hot route master. Ghost routes are legit. But anyway, um, see how see how he's gonna pull all the flat zones down against cover two. Now this comes back to zone drops, right? For sure. But a good a good cover two zone drop. If I just snap throw this out there, you see here it's still gonna get me about five to six yards. It's still it's still gonna move the ball down the field for me. Um, let me show you cover three first here. So here's cover three, snap of the ball, throw it. You see there, he is able to pick the ball off. So that's where your other routes are gonna open. So they're gonna to have to go to zone to stop this, but you have a really good zone zone beating com combinations here on this play. And all you're gonna do against cover two, if they run cover two, now this is best ran to the wide side of the field. Don't, you know, run the bubble screen to the wide side of the field. But anyway, snap of the ball, pass lead to the left, and you've got Mike Evans wide open for an absolute dot against cover two defense if they drop those flat zones back um, you're also going to have when he sits here you can playmaker this route that's what's another powerful tool um, he's going to be the route that you're going to be able to playmaker as well now if they go cover three uh, what you're going to see here is the route to Gronk um, I like to high point it um, but you don't have to you can you can literally just pass lead it wide open um, I'll show you that here Cover three. Again, I'm just going to pass it to the left. Click on. It basically acts like a crossing route. And then cover four. Um, I don't think I have cover four. But cover four is basically the same. Um, so you can low ball this route to Scotty Miller if you smart route it. If you don't smart route it, you're not going to be able to low ball it. So you want to make sure that you are smart routing Scotty Miller's route. But literally, this is one of the best plays in the game. But I, I really wanted to show you this more for the route than the actual rest of the combinations because I think you can do a lot of things with that bubble screen. The fact that that bubble screen beats man to man, if it's not an actual bubble screen, like it's a PA bubble screen, um, if it's just a bubble route, literally you can click on, you can get upfield five to 10 yards. To me, that's a huge deal. So uh, anyways, guys, I wanted to share this with you. And if you haven't already, guys, make sure to join my Discord. We've got some other tips and tricks that are coming for you soon uh, here. We've also got some, we've got a ton of videos on my channel. You probably haven't seen all of them. So we're going to throw some up for you in the screen here at the end of the video. But make sure to subscribe to the channel. We post four times a day. Uh, if you are looking for pressure, we have a ton of blitzes on my channel. Um, so we've got a bunch of stuff coming in here for Madden 21. Make sure you're in the Discord. That link below is in the description. And then last but not least, guys, I want to encourage you, come by the live stream. The live stream is a lot of fun. It's where we talk about it, answer questions live, and play Madden 21 together. So uh, if you want to come by the live stream, I play subscribers all the time. Last time locked in, last night locked on with a couple of the guys. Uh, last night I think I threw for like 760 yards on one of the games. So anyway, guys, just a lot of fun with the channel here. Make sure you're subscribed. Make sure you come by the live stream, and make sure you come into the Discord. The Discord is the best place to stay up to date with everything going on in Madden 21.